Hello my lovely people, you're welcome back to my channel. I greet you according to your time and according to the time you are seeing this video. How are you all doing? I hope you're good. Please, if you've not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. If you are a subscriber, thank you so much. My God will continue to bless you. Thank you so much and remain blessed. So the information reaching us right now, allegedly, is that Olori Ronke... <laughs> Olori Ronke have confessed. <laughs> you people have you people recall recently that it, it have been trending that Olori Ronke is pregnant with twins. That is why he have been disturbing uh, Oni of Ife, uh, saying that Oni of Ife should take take her and her children out of the country that she don't want to stay in Nigeria to carry the pregnancy. She wants to go outside the country, uh, you know, demanding a lot of things that seems impossible because she don't know that before Abraham, Jesus was born. <laughs> this same Ronke that people keep saying that she's she be old mama. Some people say that she is uh, 62 years old, while some people say that she's 52 that she cannot give birth again, although we are not God. It's the only God that says who gives birth and not, and who will not be able to give. Nothing is hard for God to do. So, but the thing is that uh, <laughs> she confessed, so she confessed. But, you know, in that palace, there have been a lot of trouble. They have People have been troubling, they have been troubling themselves. Even though Queen Nomi, they frustrated out of the house, is not there. But they have not even seen themselves and, and live. They have been giving themselves worse goes. Is it for is it only they have been disrespecting dis only the the way they want it? Is it a uh, Olori Mariam that one na uh, boss lady for this queen for this uh, uh, Ronke to come up with this uh, this her fake news about pregnancy? She have her reason. She said that since all of them stays in that palace, that only of Ife do not have their time, that only of Ife is after Queen Nomi. He's doing everything possible to know if he bring if he will bring Queen Nomi back. The last time he have, he was begging Queen Nomi to go on a vacation with with him. Why all of them are, are there in the palace looking for who will take them out? Uh -huh, you know? And the Kwinomi is it doesn't Kwinomi is, is doing shakara and Oni still have the time to beg him, to beg her and to you know buying her a lot of gifts doing this and doing that that there is no time uh, Oni of Ife would, would talk to them in that palace that he will not make reference of Kwinomi. <laughs> Just all these things are his re her reason, so watch out. So there is no time only of people will make will, will tell them something that will not make reference of Kunomi. Only people no longer look at them, no longer call, uh, celebrate their birthdays, no longer do this or do that. He's all he's all always after Kunomi, even though that Kunomi did not even have his time. Kunomi is not even ready to reciprocate to all his effort but he still have enough time to go after Kunomi, leaving all of them behind in the palace that it is only because of Kunomi have a, a son for him that is why he's doing all these things to Kunomi. that uh, the only thing that will make him to turn back to any of them in that palace is if he hears that any of them is pregnant and that is why she have to say that she's pregnant hmm. my people my people i know say now kunomi then they then they jealous thank god save that kunomi have a son it's not that I, I, I thank god that anyway thank god that she have a son but somehow if if it can be possible to say that if if she don't even have a son it would have somehow better because if had it been she don't have a son, this whole thing for don't end. She for don't go her way. There's nothing only will look back to say that look at why I want to bring this woman back to my my palace and to my life. And uh, Olori Ronke always forget that 
the thing that Oni uh, the the love that Oni have for Kunomi, if really Oni no, loves Kunomi, that he never had it for any of them. Mm-hmm. He never had it. He never get peace from any of them. He never get love, a peace of mind. You know, there's there's this peace of mind when you stay with the person you love. There's this realization when you stay with that person you truly love. So he never loved any of them. He just married them because they they charm his, they enter his eyes, and now he can and he cannot control himself because, uh, when Nomi told uh, him that you're that kind of man that cannot even control yourself. You can, when you see a woman, you cannot control yourself. That is why you keep on. You are busy marrying many wives, marrying, marrying, marrying. And this, the worst of it all is that they had it and as an agreement. You cannot even also keep a promise. So why is she wasting her time with you? That she's done. They said that Oni of uh, Oni told Oni that she's done. That she that she, Oni should re, uh, uh, erase everything that Oni have for her. That Oni should re, erase it. That is clean up. Clean it up from his mind that she is done. She's no she's no longer ready for all these things. That is what we hear that Kunomi told uh told Oni. So Ronke now because of uh Oni of Yukwe is going after Kunomi because of Tadenikawo. So he she now wants to say that she's pregnant so that Oni of Yukwe will have time to look at her. And come be say not be only one pregnancy but double that is twins. That is why she claimed that she's pregnant, that she's not pre no one when, when after saying all this thing that is because of Oni of Ife always make reference of Kunomi. Anything that Oni will tell them in the palace, Oni will call Kunomi, Kunomi this, Kunomi that. That why is it only Kunomi that that Oni is always calling? You see? That is why she wanted to go outside the country. So that she go and bring and buy baby outside and bring back for Queen, for new of Yife. This woman self, this woman self. Anyway, as the thing come be self, she don't lose her respect because with the hear say only of Yife used to respect him, respect her well. But since all these things can happen, eh, you know respect him again because when Konomi was talking to him in the in the phone, Konomi told him, please, as you delete everything that that you have for me in your mind. Go back to your place and they continue to take care of your pregnant women. <laughs> and they say that Oni of Ife told Kunomi that I don't have anybody that is pregnant for me. No woman is pregnant for me. It also means that Oni knows that Dr. No, not Dr. Olori uh, Ronke is forming that pregnant, that she's not just pregnant, she's forming it. You see? My people, oh, these people, this, this, this end time all in the palace, they are something else. They are something else. I just pray that God help Oni out of this mess that he put himself. Thank you so much for listening and please subscribe. Please subscribe, I beg you. And give the video a thumbs up. Please. Love you. Bye.